Hey guys, welcome back. So the Tesla coil project that I have been working on is taking a little longer than I anticipated. Um, I did get some good output with the flyback transformer, but it was not enough for me, so I decided to go ahead and build one of these. And what it is is a dual mount setup that I have to power the Tesla coil. The Tesla coil is not complete yet, but I am building it step by step. And this is the power supply for it. So I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick walkthrough of how it works, and I'll show you some arcs. Alright, so I now have it all hooked up, so let me go plug it in real quick, and I'll show you some of the arcs. So if you can hear that, that is the ballast buzzing in combination with the fan. So let me go ahead and get the chicken stick. Make sure you always use a chicken stick when dealing with high voltage. And let me show you some arcs. Let me adjust the camera. There you go. I now have an orange set up on one of these terminals and I will arc to it to show you the sheer power of these transformers and why is it a good reason to be safe or on high voltage and use a chicken stick. So I'm going to go ahead and arc to the orange. turn it off and I'll show you the orange so as you can see it pretty much destroyed the orange a big gash left in it a hole through the whole orange right through the middle right there you can see through it so that is a good example of why it is a good idea to, to use a chicken stick around high voltage and to be safe because this can happen to your hand or wherever it touches you so this is why it is a good idea to be safe around high voltage um, so that is my transformer. Thanks for watching and have a good one.